Right, hello guys and welcome again to Crystal Media Network. How are you doing? And compliment of the season to you guys. Um, if this is your first time to this channel, this is a channel where we talk about items of updated news on regular basis with daily upload to follow. And if this is what you are looking for, uh, try as much as possible to subscribe to this channel and open the notification bell icon on the side and you will be notified each time we drop a new clip. Follow us on Instagram as well at Chrisog Media Network. Right, very quickly, we're gonna go into the day, uh, the business of today. Uh, the American music star, Kanye West, has actually uh, said he's gonna be homeless in one year as he plans to turn all his houses into churches. Right, this is quite important, this is quite, uh, Crucial. This is quite touching. This is this has a lot of meaning attached to it because we don't know. I personally don't know the reason why someone like Kanye West, who has made money, who has made fame, you know, with eventually or with turn back to turn all his houses to uh, churches, orphanages, and stuff like that. He's a forty-four year old father of four with all the property he has. He said in the next one year, he's going to be homeless. Hmm. So when I thought about this, I was like, okay, is this possible? Could this be true that he's going to be homeless, you know, for someone who has tasted wealth, you know, back and forth to now go homeless after one year from now, uh, turning all his houses, you know, into churches or people to... Um, you know, to make use of it. Well, we will, um, let's go through exactly what he said with regards to that. He said, we are under capitalist rule and it is killing us. It is time to change that, right? I'm going to be homeless in one year. I'm going to turn all the homes I own into churches. We are making this orphanage. And I will be a place where and it will be a place where everyone can go. It should be like an artist's commune. Food should always be available. Right. As touching as this is, I'm not doubting the, the truth. I'm not doubting the reality behind what he has said. But I want to look at it critically that somebody who has tasted, if he says he's going he's gonna to build some homes, you know, and make it churches and build some homes for motherless babies, or families, charities and all of that, that's quite understandable and people be like, okay, but for you to now turn the entire houses you have into churches, orphanages, make food available for everybody, that's good on one side and that's a bit questionable on the other side and you question the truth, the reality and the authenticity behind that on the other side. So guys, what do you think about this? Do you think this is true? Do you think he's going to eventually do this? Because a year is just 365 days. Anyway, it's going to come quick. So today being uh, the date that it is, you know, do you think in the next 365 days, Kanye West will be homeless? Do you think so? With all the wealth, cars, houses, you know, home and abroad, you know, across the world, turn everything to churches and orphanage. And he, was, he, being the owner, will remain homeless. We don't know. Maybe it's going to be second Jesus Christ. Maybe God has made it start to him to do that. We don't know what's, what's happening. But believe you me, we're going to keep track of it. We're going to actually follow this suit and follow it back to back in the next 365 days, God willing, if we are still alive, to see if that has actually come true. If he's actually done what he said he's going to do the next 365 days. Uh, this. Guys, do you think this is real? Do you think he's going to do that? Or do you think there's something that is not really clear about it? Whatever it is, why don't you just share that in the comment section for us so that everyone, you know, can actually uh, learn from that. It's quite important because your comments are quite important because the essence of that, it makes the whole thing, um, how do I put it? You make it like an interactive kind of uh session a video what have you you know it's very important that's exactly what he said he said he's going to turn the entire houses he's got into a churches an orphanage for people to be you to use it and food will be available for all that comes in there we follow that uh, right this is another one which i think i should let you know guys um twitter removed the post of the vice president yemi Oshimbajo. Right. The reason is that 
uh, the Vice President Yemi Osimbajo violates the copyrights by using one of the Beyonce's tracks. Right, so the Vice President Yemi Osimbajo has uh, shared in a commemoration of the International Women's Day, the theme song used for the video was Beyonce Run the World. So he used Beyonce track Run the World at the commemoration of the uh, International Mother's Day without obtaining the right permission, without following the right channel. So because of this, Twitter removed that particular post. Right, how did Twitter get to know that he did not obtain the right uh, permission, did not get the permission from the owner, from, you know, copyright thing before using that particular track. How did, did uh, uh, Twitter know about it? Right, a Twitter user was the one who actually leaked this out. Listen to this. A Twitter user modified the social media giant, notified the social media giant about a tweet alleging that Oshimba has never done this job, done his job properly, and is allegedly using American Moses Stark song without permission. So it was another Twitter user who alerted or who notified Twitter that Osibajo has used that particular song without obtaining the right permission. Right. It's 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 quite it's funny, but quite a lot of people are actually thrown comment to say maybe he's one of those uh people that don't even like Osibajo at all because ordinarily why would you go and you know inform twitter itself to say you know what this person has used this particular song without obtaining um the right uh, permission to be able to do so now listen nigerian current vice president who has never who has never properly done his job right has used your song without permission ask jack your good friend to take care of his account in accordance with dmca violation penalty so what this person had done that's that's the uh the what's it called the twitter user the one i was talking about informed sent this particular dm to beyonce you know and beyonce had to report this particular one to uh the incident to uh the twitter and twitter had to take action so what i'm trying to let you know is that that post was taken down you know for some reason when um nigeria banned twitter and, uh, you know, it, it kind of killed a lot of things. A lot of people are still very much angry with regard to that uh, step they took to have cancelled Twitter. It cancels a, a lot of businesses uh, destroyed. You know, people cannot transact their businesses. People cannot do a lot of things. People lost their jobs. People lost money and different kinds of things as a result of the cancellation or a ban placed on Twitter. That's quite sad and very, very uh, terrible. Right, guys, we're going to be coming back again to uh, talk to you with regard to the latest items of news. And before I go, if this is your first time on this channel, we do daily upload. And if this is what you are interested in, try as much as possible to click on the subscribe button. This is going to really help us. The more we get subscribers, the more we are able to expand our tentacles to be able to bring to you daily items of news you know, on sports, politics, celebrities, economy, and general happiness across the globe. You know, it's going to really help us. We're going to get more people to be able to get into the core of incident and scene of incidents to be able to get us the direct news. So we'll be able to bring that to you. So you can share this particular program for people to be able to subscribe to this channel, like us and comment, you know, and uh, uh, share. This is really going to help us. And then open the notification bell icon on the side so that you'll be notified each time we drop a new clip this is all i've got for you now and i'll be coming your way again take care and enjoy the rest of your day bye